Personal get back your list box. Go to settings, sheet properties, object stamp. Your list box select this one. Properties. I can here we have given condition right. Layout tab. Show always. Your list box. Okay. For example, if we make if you select 2010. Now itself all the aggregations will be calculated according to 2010. If you select 2011, now itself all the aggregations will be calculated according to 2011. So, for example, if you want to calculate aggregations based on non-selected data, in such cases also we need to go for set analysis. And let's set expressions in some other tab. Layout, add sheet. Yes, control C, control V. Let's to copy paste this one. I'll remove this object. Okay. Right click, new sheet object. By using text object, by using text object, we can evaluate expressions, right? Here, alert, sum of sales. Sum of sales represents current selections. Current selection. See? For example, if we select 2011, we will display 2011 sales, 2010, 2010 sales, 8, 2008 sales, 5, 2005 sales, like this, 2005, Australia, here equal to 2005 and country equal to Australia sales, this one. Sum of sales represents current selection sales. Right click, new sheet object. Text object. In text object, we want to write expressions. First, we need to give equal symbol. Sum of sales. Before sales. In curly brackets. To give 1. Go to caption tab. Total sales. See? For example, if we make selection here, see, this value is changing, but it is not changing. Independent of current selection, it will always display total sales only. Whatever we make selection here, this value will not be changed. Always it will display total sales, independent of current selection. And it will display current selection sales. Sum of sales, sum of sales within dollar, same, equal to sum of sales, in set, give dollar. Just for identification purpose, I'll use sales dollar. See, this one, this one are same. Both will be changed based on current selection of data. This one, this one are same. These values will be changed based on current selection of data. Let's play current selection sales. Equal to sum of sales. We can set 1 minus dollar. Excluded.
y0 total sales current collection initially same so this minus this one now for example let's select 2011 see from this total sales we manage we reduce this one value is this one see total sales are 231 72 double three minus current selection sales 623717 623717 see exclude says 1693516 1693516 okay now right click new sheet object text object equal to sum of sales and set analysis syntax set analysis curly brackets then identify dollar then mod where less than greater than within the mod where in between less than greater than we need to give condition here you are equal to 2010 we need to give this one within set here equal to 2010 I'll give label as from this page 2010 just for identification purpose for example if we select 2010 say 561810 it will always display whatever we make selections in the year Will always display 2010 sales only. Always display 2010 sales only. Why? Because here we have given condition as year equal to 2010. Text object equal to sum of sales. sum of sales then identify a modifier within set within curly brackets we need to give identifier 1 then modifier less than greater than then now within the modifier now within the modifier we need to give condition your condition is year equal to 2000 now see what the difference between this one and this one as of now it is displaying these two are same okay as of now these two are same now let's say for example say here i have selected whatever make selection these two are displaying same value sales for 2010 only but say here i'll display canada after selecting above this one certainly you said canada this value is changing but this value is not changing here we have given dollar here we have given one okay what will happen is if we give dollar it will take given condition plus it will include other object selection now this is sales for see here whatever we make selection always year equal to 2010 here whatever we make selection it will take always year equal to 2010 only so now see this value is for this value is for year equal to 2010 why because we have given 2010 in condition year equal to 2010 and country equal to canada and this value is only for year equal to 2010 only it is always only given condition only it will display always given condition only it will not include other object selection if we give dollar it will include other object selection in addition to given condition it will include other object selection and if you give one it will not include other object selection always it will display sales for given condition only 
to highlight current selection cells here we will change I'll use change background color font bold increase size font color to white just to highlight current selection okay now right click new sheet object next object will do sum of sales Within curly brackets, identify the modifier. Set analysis syntax. We need to remember set analysis syntax. And within the modifier, we need to give condition. Here, condition is country equal to country equal to within set within single quotes Canada. Canada sales. See? You are not displaying Canada. So, instead of writing this one, select this one. Simply if you try to type, it will display suggestions. Select this one, it will display. Canada sales double five four nine seven double five four nine seven under country whatever we make selection here it will always display Canada sales only always it will take country equal to Canada only and it will include other object selection country equal to Canada and year equal to 2000 same value given condition plus it will include other object selection why because here we have given dollar and if you give one means, it will not include other object selection. Always it will display Canada sales only. Canada sales. Equal to sum of sales. Identify one, then more fair, less than greater than. Within the more fair, we need to give condition. Country equal to Canada. Canada only. Just for the education purpose. Same. Whatever you select here, always will display Canada sales only. In addition to this one, so if you select 2010, see, this is changing and this value is not changing. This one is always given condition only, and this one is given condition plus it will include other object selection. There is difference between dollar and one. Text object equal to sum of sales set analysis syntax condition is country equal to Canada in set Comma and year equal to 
2011. Canada, 2011. So we are equal to 2011. So Canada, 20,300. 20,300. Two thousand eleven, Canada. This one plus it will include other objects selection. Right, because here I have given dollar. If you give one means it will not include this selection. It will be always displays twenty thousand three hundred only. Right click, new sheet object, text object equal to sum of sales, then set of the syntax, then curly brackets, identify then marker. To give conditions here equal to So 2010 11, see, double one eight double five two seven, double one eight double five two seven. Right click, new sheet object, text object, equal to sum of sales. Set analysis syntax. Then within the model, we want to give condition. Your ER equal to within set within level course. I will give conditions greater than 2009. Sales greater than 2009. Greater than 2009 means same. Sales for 2010 and 2011. Same value. 